in this video we will find the integral of 1 upon 1 plus sec x so first of all we will multiply this fraction by 1 minus sec x upon 1 minus sec x so we have 1 multiply by 1 minus sec x is 1 minus sec x and here we will apply the formula a plus b multiply by a minus b so we have a square minus b square or we can say we have 1 square which is 1 minus sec square x now we know that 1 minus sec square x is minus 10 square x and then we can take minus common in the numerator so we have minus times sec x minus 1 upon minus 10 square x dx so we have sec x minus 1 upon 10 square x now we can break the fraction so we have sec x upon 10 square x minus 1 upon 10 square x now this can be written as sec x and 1 upon 10 square x is cot square x so we have cot square x in place of 1 upon 10 square x now we know that sec x is 1 upon cos x and cot x is cos x upon sin x so we have cos square x upon sin square x and in place of cot square x we can put cosec square x minus 1 Now we can cancel this cos x and this is square so we have cos x upon sin square x dx then minus integral of cosec square x dx then minus minus plus integral of 1 dx. Now here we can see that we have sin square x in the denominator so suppose let u is equal to sin x so the differential du is equal to the derivative of sin x which is cos x dx so the integral of cos x dx upon sin square x can be written as du upon u square or we can say that u raised to the power minus 2 du and here we will apply the power rule of integration so we have u to the power minus 2 plus 1 upon minus 2 plus 1 so we have u raised to the power minus 1 upon minus 1 and this can be written as minus 1 upon u and then we will put the value of u which is sin x so we have minus 1 upon sin x so the integral of cos x upon sin square x is minus 1 upon sin x so we will add minus 1 upon sin x minus now the integral of cos x square x is minus cot x and the integral of 1 is x 1 upon sin x is minus, uh, cos x so we have minus cos x and minus minus plus cot x plus x plus c or this can be written as cot x minus cos x plus x plus c and this is the required answer.